All right, we can bring it to it. Do the last book. All right, praise the Lord, everybody. Come on in. Uh, this is Bishop T. L. Williams, Senior, better known as a relief doctor. We are coming to you. Man, I am excited about what God is yet getting ready to do in our behalf. Praise the Lord. We're we're alive here. Hold on. Let me get my stuff here to make sure I can be able to see you. Make sure I can see you. Y'all can see me. Okay, we are on. All right. What's going on, Latanya? Praise the Lord. Uh all right, y'all come on so I can maybe see your comments here. Uh praise the Lord. And um just give everybody a few more minutes that want to join in. You know we've been uh promoting, 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 promoting. Praise God. And I'm just excited about what yet God is doing uh in this time in this season. Uh, as we are getting ready to embark upon uh, a major, a major uh, kingdom uh, assignment that God has given us, uh, praise God! And uh, man, I am, I am um, just uh, uh, elated about about God trusting me with this assignment. Uh, been been working on this a long time. Um, and so just give y'all a few more minutes and if you can, uh, those that come on, if you just, uh, uh, put it into the chat, introduce yourself to me, uh, praise the Lord. We're going to interact, uh, pretty good here and it's not going to be a long, a long drawn out, uh, webinar, not, uh, we're just going to present to you what we have, uh, for those that, uh, interested. Of course, this, this is, uh, mainly for. Uh, this is mainly for uh, those uh, who are uh, in ministry, uh, the called by God uh, to preach the gospel. What's going on, Shanet? God bless you. Uh, preaching the gospel, teaching the word of God, the gifted. What's going on, uh, Ms. Margaret? God bless you. Um, man, I just want to be able to share my pure heart today. Uh, this is something that uh, really is dear to me. This is this is. Uh, this is uh, my new baby uh, that I've been work working on um, in spite of everything that's been going on in ministry. Uh, we're uh, we finally here. Um, and so we're going to share some things with you, uh, give you opportunity. Um, is um, just want to set it up, get it in motion, and uh, we're going to see what the Lord is going to do. And once you hear some of the things, and I've been kind of debating how uh, I was going to present this, whether I'm going to do PowerPoint. I'm going to do a little bit of PowerPoint. I'm not going to do a, a whole lot because I want to I want to connect with you. Okay, I want to connect with you. This is going to be uh, the first of uh, a few webinars uh, this month. I'm kind of expand them out because we're getting ready to open the doors uh, for our new preaching network. Um, and we're going to explain some things to you. I've uh, been, been sharing to some, some pastors, some preachers, and, and um, uh, we're just getting the appetizing going. We've, we've been a push this, uh, Lord Jesus, as far as the Lord let us push it. And um, I believe uh, that you will grab hold to the vision that God has shared with me for, for this network. And um, so I'm going to give about uh, two more minutes, and then I'm going to go forth. Uh, in this, and of course, we I know normally this is our time for our health tips and dealing with health, but uh, but I chose to do it on this Monday, uh, because the first of the month, rather, and then too, uh, with with pastors, because I want to connect with pastors and those that are in ministry, uh, the preaching, teaching the word of God. Uh, normally, this uh, Monday is a, a light day, most are not uh, doing too much unless they're in revival or traveling or what have you. Uh, but most most uh, are kind of freed up, resting from from labor uh, over the weekend, and so I uh, just wanted to tap in. What's going on, Bishop? Uh, uh, God bless you. And so uh, we're gonna buy another minute, then we're gonna launch into this. Um, and if y'all would, y'all share this for me. I certainly appreciate it. Uh, all those that did sign up, and know everybody might not be able to make it, and there will be a replay uh, for those that can't make it. And so we want to put this out. And so I want to share with you 
uh, some things and then um, those feel led by the Lord that this be a great connection for you and your ministry. Um, uh, you know, you have opportunity uh, to lock in spots because it's going to be key uh, once once we reveal to you uh, the importance of things. There's some things I'm going to show to you on the screen. Um, so I want to let you know that I'm going to do a little small PowerPoint. I'm going to show you some information on the screen. And then, um, like I said today, I really wanted to connect with you. OK, I'm, I'm, you know, I'm a kind of like a, uh, a personal type person. And because I've been doing marketing and stuff, a lot of times people do PowerPoints. Can't on you don't know. All you hear is a voice. Don't see the face. I want y'all to see me because y'all going to see a whole lot of me. Uh, praise God. We're going to be we're going to be around. But I want to open up in prayer. Uh, praise the Lord. Uh, if you don't mind, I uh, just want to uh, just believe in prayer and then we we just not just jumping out and just doing something we uh we know we're being led by the lord on this eternal god we come thanking you god for uh this uh, assignment that you had given us god we give you praise and give you honor and god we humbly submit ourselves unto you and god we thank you for trusting us with this kingdom assignment god you had given to us and and father we thank you god for uh uh you're uh, uh putting things in place and line things to line up and for a time like this god that you have graced us uh to to be able to uh, be a blessing to the body of christ and father we thank you that you would touch every heart and it comes in to see what we have to offer. And God, we thank you, God, that you speak to them. And God, if you uh, directed them in this direction to expand their ministry uh, through media and, and do, do those areas, God, to, to reach uh, even the masses. And Father, we thank you that you'll bless them. And God, we even speak now uh, to their budgets and the finances, God, that all of those things will come into play. And God, that you will bless them. And God, that I did see every need be met over and above. And God, we just thank you, uh, God, that you just move now. And Father God, we give you glory. Cover us with the blood of Jesus. And Father, we thank you, and God, that you uh, continue to be with us and lead us through this whole presentation. And Father, we give you praise in Jesus' name. Amen. And thank God. Well, I just want to do that. I'm, I'm a man that believes in prayer. I praise God. And look, I want to uh, want to. Uh, thank all of you all taking time out of your schedule for joining in with us here once I know many of you know me some don't that and then those who uh, be watching this uh, a little later um, uh, probably have met me I want to introduce myself I am Bishop Tommy L. Williams Sr. better known as the Relief Doctor uh, I am the proud pastor of Keys to the Kingdom uh, International Ministries uh, praise God right here in Memphis Tennessee uh, I've been uh pastoring for uh 20 years as a matter of fact this is my 20th year of pastoring i've been preaching for 31 years i have a uh a, two doctor degrees two earned doctor degrees uh praise the lord uh, in christian psychology and then also in theology and of course I graduated from jacksonville theological seminary uh there in jacksonville um uh, Florida, praise God. And so we're, uh, man, we're excited. Uh, of course, I'm married. I've uh, been married now. And also, this will be our 20th year of marriage. Uh, praise God. Also, me and my wife, Daphne Williams. And uh, look, we we are excited to be able to offer this service to the body of Christ. Uh, I just want you to know that uh, I believe this is going to be a blessing uh, to you. Um, this is something that uh, um, has been uh, on my plate for a long time. And, and this is not my first time bringing this. Uh, there was uh, probably four years, now five years ago now, I, uh, when streaming just really, uh, when streaming just started coming, uh, uh, coming out, I had got approved for uh, Facebook to be able to do it. I was going to do the broadcast right inside of Facebook. And that's when everything was just getting hot with Facebook and that I got approved. And then I had some developers that was working on uh, some things for me, but we just couldn't get it. I, I could, and they couldn't get it done to my liking. Uh, I'd like to be a man of excellence, um, you know, things I'm going to present, especially for God. I will make sure that it, it's right. And so I pulled the project. But I never gave up on the vision. Okay, never gave up on the vision until uh, things began to come into play while I was doing something else and getting ready to launch some other things. Uh, this door came open, I knew, and then the Holy Spirit reminded me 
Lord have mercy, of the assignment that he gave me five years ago. He said, now is the time to go forth. Uh, he said, go forth and do it, Lord Jesus. And, and I'm going to tell you what, what scripture really motivated me. Uh, what motivated me, I'm going I'm to I'm pull my Bible out. I, I should put it up on, on PowerPoint. But uh, First Chronicles, uh, yeah, First Chronicles uh, chapter 28, verse 20. This is a scripture that motivated me. This is our scripture, right? Man, I'm telling you to go forth. When I'm meditating on this in the Holy Spirit, what's going on, Jeffrey? And the Holy Spirit uh, uh, reminded me of the uh, of the assignment. And uh, and this is what it says. It says the verse uh, 20 and 21, 1 Chronicles 28, 20, 21. Just want to share this with you, and then we're going to move forward with the presentation. It says, and David said to Solomon, uh, his son, be strong and of good courage and do it man and and do it that thing kept what's going on mark thompson this thing kept jumping at me and do it he says fear not nor be dismayed for the lord god even my god will be with thee he will not fail thee nor forsake thee until thou hast finished all the work for the service of the house of the lord wow and um and you can read uh, verse 20 21 but this was the scripture that that really motivated me really opened my eyes and, and when i was mellow i just read it just meditating on it and the lord really uh 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 man began to minister to me and then the whole spirit brought back the vision that i had five years ago and uh now things are in place and it is time to do it so what am I talking about, okay? What I'm talking about? Well, let me bring it up on the screen here. Let me bring this to, the, to you on the screen. And like I said, we'll be sharing some things with you. Uh, and uh, I want to uh, definitely do this uh, for you. Hold on, make sure I got the right one. Okay, here we go. Okay, so I can introduce it to you. Praise the Lord. There we go. Now, here we go. Well, what you see on the screen there is called, I hope y'all still can see me there, a little small box there, is Local Ministry Network, okay? Local Ministry Network. Uh, and, and basically, and here's our main, our main slogan, man. This thing here uh, is something that I believe in. Giving a, a, uh, a, is actually giving local ministries the, uh, the global experience, okay? Giving local ministries the global experience, okay? Giving local ministries, uh, giving local ministries uh, the global experience. And this is one of the things that I believe in. Uh, this is my opinion, okay? Uh, I'm just, uh, just put it to you like this. This is my, my opinion, but I just believe this, okay? I, I just believe this that there are many, okay, uh, many um, known it, uh, women, men and women of God. And I want y'all to grab this, okay? I just believe this, that uh, God has called to preach his gospel. Uh, but the problem is they don't have the resources and they don't, have the opportunity nor the platform uh, to be exposed. That's just, that just in my heart, always has been what's going on. Mr. Sneak, God bless you. This is something that has been in my heart, okay? Has been in my heart. Uh, uh, there are many, and I just believe that if God called you, and uh, man, I'm talking about a real calling. I ain't talking about just making up stuff. I'm talking about a real calling. If God has called you, I believe that you have something to say, something to share that is significant uh, to the body of Christ. They'll being uh, make an impact on this world. But one of the problems is that that uh, everybody don't get the opportunity that some of the mega pastors, mega churches, of course they had to make all the time. They grew doing things and and the grace of God on them. But they have resources and have opportunities that some other uh, men and women of God don't don't care what's going on over to that don't don't have opportunity to do it. And I just believe this. And this is one of the, my motivator. I love preachers. I do. I love preachers. I'm a little hard on some of them because I want them to do the thing right. You know, I just want them to do it right. 
But for those that are in order, those that are uh, 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 really have a real calling for God, um, I already have prayed and God, what's going on, Bishop uh, McBee? God bless y'all for coming on in. Uh, I just believe God um, has graced this opportunity for me to be able to do this. Um, now, what I want to present to you is Local Ministry Network, okay? Local Ministry Network. This is our logo. Uh, this is uh, just our logo. And I want you to uh, to really to uh, uh, grab hold of this. You're going to see a whole lot of this. Local Ministry Network, okay? Uh, it's it's uh, a new, pre I, I'm not competing. I'm not trying to compete. No, no kind of way with Word Network and the Now Network and and TBN, Daystar, all the ones that you are. Uh, uh, for this is not about competition. This is about expanding the kingdom of God. Okay, uh, but I want you to be able to recognize some things too. Okay, I want you to recognize some things that this is why it's so important that time has changed um, and uh, those that. Fail to change with the time or make adjustments, always suffer and lose out. And, and so we got to be innovated, uh, even in ministry. The church got to be innovative. Don't change the foundation. Don't change the uh, the word of God, which you teach again. But uh, but presentation, uh, we have to make adjustments according to uh, uh, to our generations that we're in now. And we know. Uh, we know that this generation is a little different than the ones that a lot of us came up in. And so we got to be innovated in how to tap into this generation. And so we got to recognize some things. Technology, we are in the technology age. Okay. And it's important that we begin to understand that. And so we got to make an adjustment. We can't we can't be dinosaurs all our lives. We got to make some adjustments, uh, even in our ministry, so we can be more effective. And so I want to share with you our, our mission. Okay, I want to share with you our mission and then we'll get, get back to some other stuff and then we'll share some things with you uh, about uh, how this platform is going to work, what it's going to do, and then uh, how much it's going to cost you and all of those things there. It's going to it's gonna blow your mind. It's going to bless your life. I'm going to share some things with you, some reality stuff. Okay, just ain't nothing I just throw together. It's something that man been before the Lord for a long time. Uh, it just basically a king assignment. Our uh, our mission is to expand the kingdom of God through the preach and taught word of God, utilizing technology and media pro platforms, opening doors for great men and women uh, who have been called by God and present their anointed gifts to the world that Jesus would be lifted up worldwide. That's our mission. That's our mission, okay? That's our mission. And everything that we're going to do here at Local Ministry Network and, and uh, 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 it's going gonna, it's gonna to exemplify that in many ways. Now, I'll give you a little bit of my background outside of preaching. I have uh, been a uh, online marketer for about 10 years now. Uh, um, uh, so I'm, I'm kind of, I'm kind of a little techie guy, not real techie. I'm not geeky, but I'm a little techie. Um, uh, uh, and, and I love media stuff and I love this. Uh, I have been, uh, I have been, uh, on radio started out and, uh, radio here in Memphis and been, uh, man, uh, uh, we started out, I think 1240 AM there in South Haven when we first started out on, on radio there. And then from there, we expanded. Uh, I used to do live radio, you know, just, I, I had tape stuff too, but I used to do live uh, ministry on radio there at 1240 AM. Then of course we uh, expanded. God opened up doors to where uh, I did live uh, shows there on WLOK. Uh, then the Lord blessed me when Janice Good Love was was there in WDIA. I used to go there uh, doing a nighttime show when she was coming on late at night. Uh, yeah, even on the secular radio station, God opened doors for me to do uh, uh, at least uh, once or twice a month. Uh, praise God. And then uh, 1380 when uh, 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 Apostle A.L. Williams had his radio station going there. God blessed me to be there. I was there doing the teaching and a lot, a lot of things on deliverance. Uh, there and of course the priest word. Uh, then I had syndicated uh, uh, a broadcast, a uh, radio broadcast uh, in uh, Florida, Nebraska. Uh, I think I was uh, in uh, uh, like New Jersey and a couple other places. I had syndicated uh, 
uh, radio. So I've been doing radio a long time easy. And then, of course, we started, uh, I went to TV. We shifted from radio to TV. Um, so uh, I, uh, I was, uh, of course, on the, on a uh, free access channel for a little bit. Uh, but I always, yeah, I had that thing about just moving up to, to that, uh, to that uh, next level. And so, so God blessed us. Uh, God blessed us to be on uh, uh, Iron TV. Iron TV now and uh, Channel Twelve uh, there. Uh, we was there for a year or two, and then actually, uh, uh, when a Good News uh, 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 station came, uh, I was one of I think uh, Bishop. Uh, right from uh, Liberty Church, God in Christ, we were uh, one of the first two here directly in ministry uh, that they um, put on their station here in the city. Uh, we was right here in the city and they came to me. Matter of fact, they came to me uh, just when my contract was ending with Iron TV. Uh, and so it was Pac TV, uh, uh, Pac TV did, did they change the name to Iron TV. Uh, so we, we went there and I was there for a while and then we uh, we left there and disbanded and went to ABC. God had gave us a prime time spot with ABC uh, here, uh, man, on Sunday morning, 6, 6 a.m. Lord help me. And man, we had a great time ministering there to the Lord. Uh, uh, told us the time to come off TV. He took us off TV for the season and then revamping things. And then that's when we was getting ready to go forward. Then I started doing stuff online, not the Facebook live stuff. I started doing other things online uh, with our ministry. And then, um, uh, so I have a, I have somewhat uh, some great knowledge. Uh, what's going on, Ms. Smith? God bless you, Pastor. Uh, I have some great knowledge uh, about TV and radio, about media. And then along with my um, uh, my marketing, uh, um, um, uh, experience. Uh, I kind of know some things and, and, and I get access to some things and I get uh, uh, information about things and how things are happening. Uh, okay, things are happening. Let me take this off the screen so I can I can come back uh, to you. Uh, I want to come back to you and I want to uh, bring some other information to you, okay? Let me do this here. I don't know what I was thinking about. Okay, stop sharing. Okay, here we go. Uh, so, so we kind of got that. I kind of understand the ins and out and, uh, of importance. So I'm gonna share some information with you on what whether you sign up with me or not. I want you to be able to understand that it's important for you as a man or woman of God. And understand, you don't have to be a pastor to be able to uh, to to uh, bring your ministry to the next level. Okay. Uh, this ain't just for pastors, okay? This is for those who have been called into the ministry, uh, and it's important. Then we got to expand our ministry. Uh, uh, it's important that we understand that that we got to be be ready to shift, okay? We got to be ready to shift our ministries. I know we we hear the cliche, uh, God finna shift, God finna shift, this and that, and we had not seen a whole lot of shifting in a lot of ways. But but there got to be some tangible shifting, okay? And this is one of the things that we I, I believe that we got to do. We got to shift our ministry, okay? Uh, our understanding that uh, knocking on the door still work, okay? Want y'all to grab this? Knocking on the door still work, and we still need to do that. But there are some things we got to add to it, okay? Uh, if we're gonna be effective to to not just to fill our churches up, but to get the word about Jesus Christ. Come on. We, we, we still got to do that. that. That commission is still alive and there's still our responsibility, but we got to change our methods because this generation is a little different. I know we build in big buildings, but everybody ain't coming because we build a building. Used to be you build a building, folks came. But we're building buildings now, folks are, are, are not coming. And then we got big buildings and people are leaving. OK, so that means that we got to do something and we got to ship. Uh, we got to go since, since they are not coming where we are, then we got to now start doing innovative things to start going where they are. Come on. That's what we should be doing anyway. We should be going. Uh, but we didn't got so comfortable. Uh, people are coming to us. 
But 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 watch now, they still will come to us, but we need to do things that will attract them to come. And I'm talking about staying in God. I ain't talking about doing all this stuff that uh, that eliminate uh, that that kind of uh, uh, emulates uh, of the world to try to attract them. No, we want to attract them uh, with godliness, but we got to be able to do things that's going to attract them. We got to meet them where they at. It's not that they're not looking for God. But, but they some of them just refuse to do it the old way. And so we got to let them understand um, that, that the church is innovative. And so these are some of the things that we must do. Uh, uh, and we got to start doing because this generation is different. And, and so where are this generation? Where, where they hang out at? They hang out on social media. They hang out on the, their own phones. They, uh, they're doing things on their phones. What's going on, Brandon? Uh, uh, they're doing things on their phone. they on social media all the time. And so what can the church do? How can the church tap into that? I'm going to give you some uh, some staggering numbers in a minute. And uh, we got to be able to do this. OK, we got to be able to do this and understanding uh, uh, that uh, this is part of ministry. This is outreach. The outreach game has changed. Passing out tracks, man, that that they, they, as soon as you give it to them, if, after you leave their present, they probably throw them away. Uh, so, so we got to change up some stuff. Okay. Uh, uh, we got to change up some stuff. We can't be afraid to step out there and we got to utilize even the minds of our young people in our churches. We got to communicate with them, got to talk with them and find out what's going on. So, so those that are disconnected can, can stay connected. Come on. You ain't got to be the one to do it, but there's somebody in your ministry that's gifted for this. And so bring them on in. And so you can expand your ministry. Uh, uh, one of the things, the reason I call it local ministry, uh, because uh, uh, my, my heart is to give those local ministries opportunities, okay? Local ministries, opportunities that that the uh, larger ministries have. And we want to be able to bring it to you at an affordable uh, uh, price and opportunity so so we can level the playing ground. Because, man, we got some great men and women of God that uh, that people had never heard, never seen, just just in your local circle. And so it's time now. And, you know, we've been hearing folks tell me it's time to go to the next level. What's going on, uh, Prophet D? It's time to go to the next level. It's time that this here, God going to do this here. Well, here it is. Opportunities is coming to the door. Prayers are finna be out through local ministry network and some things is getting ready to happen i'm telling you it's it's um, i know this is god uh, how things have just transpired how things have fell in place uh so so this is one of the things now uh, uh we got to recognize and all of us know this that regular tv is fading out it's almost it, it's it's already at the funeral home i have to put it like that they get they get ready to uh, come on when they get ready to have the weight and all this stuff here uh it's, it's already there what's going on sweetheart uh uh it's already there okay so 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 now we got to what we gonna do regular tv is dying out it's already very expensive Okay, you know, uh, uh, being on uh, on on TBN and and being on uh, uh, Word Network, man, it takes a month budget just to have for one thirty minute broadcast. Okay, it's very costly. Uh, uh, I, I promise you, when I was on ABC, when I was on ABC, and uh, uh, man, we was paying uh, well, it was five hundred dollars. I had a prime time spot Sunday morning, every Sunday morning, six a.m. Uh, uh, $500, it cost me $500 a week for a 30 minute broadcast. And, and my reach was just maybe, uh, here, Mississippi, a little bit of Arkansas and, and lip parts of Oklahoma. That's as far as my reach was. And I paid $500 a week. And man, I'll, I'll tell you, and it wasn't like it was just in the budget, in the budget, but I was being obedient to God, what God did. And, and God met the budget all the time. And, and you know, and, and so th th that wasn't the issue. But what I'm saying, it was costly. It, you know, God didn't bless me. And I, you know, I experienced the uh, TBN experience and, and different things, different areas. God opened up doors there, but I had, hadn't did the word network yet. Uh, uh, but, but then yet, uh, I said, okay, God, we, I know this is the way we got to go. So, so he began to deal with me about how I'm doing it. And then because me being a marketer, being connected to people that are developers and, and, and all this new stuff are coming down the pipe, a lot of times I get to hear about it before the public hears about it. So I get inside track on some things, okay, uh, because of the people I deal with in the business world. And, and, and so now I see this thing. I said, this is it. 
Uh, I know some of you all are now, uh, you know, the cable is what fade now, very expensive, but it's fade now. And and, um, and what is happening now, uh, live streaming TV is it. Uh, they tried to fight it. Uh, they tried to, you know, so y'all start doing it with the Cody boxes and all that, but they tried to fight it. Uh, they tried to fight it. Uh, the, the, the cable networks and all that, they tried to fight it. But they realize that well, we better join them because we sure can't beat them. And, and, and that's the thing that we got to understand. So, so a lot of the TV networks are already adjusting, already putting their stuff on live streaming now. Why is that? Because that is where everybody is. That's where it's there, okay? Uh, uh, it's less costly now. Now, of course, live streaming is going to cost you a little bit more than Netflix, but it's cheaper than cable and satellite and all of that. But but it's going to be worth it, okay? I'm telling you, it's going to be worth it. And so uh, uh, the, uh, the platform that Local Ministry Network is going to have is going to be, we're going to be streaming live on Roku, okay? Amazon Fire TV and uh coming real soon apple tv wow and, and those are the top three okay those are the top three uh networks uh that, that you basically want to uh deal with okay and, and so uh, why is it important for us to uh, understand uh, to understand uh, 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 this streaming thing. We got to, all right. I know a lot of us, we do a lot of streaming on, uh, we do a lot of streaming on, uh, Facebook live. I do a lot of, do my shows there. Okay. But, but I want, I want you to see, I want you to see some things. Okay. I want you to see some things here. Uh, I got a little information here. I just let you know the numbers that you have opportunity to be before and how powerful this thing is. And, and I knew when Amazon, decided roku had been out there a while and they they've been the top leader but amazon that came through the back door okay have came through the back door are you hearing me that came through the back door that's right uh uh taurus wow i ain't through yet it's gonna blow your mind uh what we have what's going on and uh um and it's coming through uh came through the back door when amazon got on board and when they created most y'all probably have it now the amazon five stick the Amazon Fire TV, man, I'm telling you, it is crazy. Uh, and Roku, I know you saying, well, uh, 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 see, uh, uh, now you got YouTube uh, TV, and you see, you got you got all of uh, Hulu and all the other things coming up. Why? Because uh, that's where everything is now. And so now the church got to be ready to shift. Uh, and so what local uh, ministry network is going to do, it's going to put you there, uh, God Almighty, at ground floor level. And anybody know anything about business? If you want to get in business, well, get in the ground floor, you're going to be all right if you just stay in there. Come on, because when everybody catch up, you already there and they're going to keep boosting you on up higher. And so with local ministry network, that's why we ain't trying to try compete. compete with uh, uh the word network i love them watch them all the time tvn love them they stop I'm, I'm not we're not trying to compete we're just positioning ourselves where everybody are for in this generation come on and and, and then we're gonna open the door up to where we're gonna set a standard <laughs> Jesus, boy, I, I, I ain't gonna have time to go through my whole vision on, on all this while we're gonna have some uh, other webinars out of the boy. Y'all understand my vision that I have because I'm a person that have experience being on TV, some things I wanted, couldn't, because I couldn't afford it and things that, and I, you know, and then I'm a preacher too. And I understand budgets and I understand that, you know, it, it's hard to try to do this and just trying to keep the lights on. Then time I do extra stuff. So I understand all of that. And so what you're getting uh, is somebody who, who, who's been on both sides and have the compassion, but also have the anointing and the assignment from God to present this. I'm telling you. And then I love preachers. Oh, Jesus. <laughs> Lord help me and, and watch this uh, so, so watch Amazon Fire TV leads the overall streaming platform uh, Roku, uh, 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 now, uh, Roku uh, 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 basically used to be number one but Amazon has snuck up through the back door and, and has, has came on in now since January uh, uh, now this is the audience not saying everybody's going to watch but I want you to understand the power behind this is that 
uh, uh, Amazon by itself has reached now since January of this year, have reached over 30 million uh, people, God Almighty, uh, viewers on Amazon Fire TV. Roku now is actually uh, at 29 million. So uh, when, when you begin to look at that, Lord help us. Uh, uh, and, and not only that, it's constantly increasing. And, and so when you begin to look at uh, uh, well, one platform gives you about uh, uh, 30, uh, Really, it's almost really about 34 million. I take that back. I'm sorry, Amazon. I apologize. <laughs> uh, 34 million. And then Roku uh, is that 29 million uh, homes that you have opportunity to be in front of. We know we're not going to get 100%. What if you got just only 5% of those during your broadcast? Lord, help me. I, I know you can be on the Word Network. You can be over in the homes of a million uh, people. Uh, but but look at this. I want you to understand the power behind this. That somebody that uh, uh, you only known in your in your little circle, in your area, your community, and some of you can spend a little bit further out because you know other people connections. But but now you gonna get a chance to be known. Uh, and be exposed in the gift and the revelation that God has given you, man, uh, uh, worldwide, because you're going to be global. Amazon is global. Roku is global. <laughs> well, I'm going to read some information here to you. Now, I'm going to put it on the screen, read some information to you. Now, the new figures for Amazon Fire TV uh, 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 was shared just recently. And so that's why I found out that uh, Amazon is now the number one streaming a uh, 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 platform. Now, the platform is also in the U United States, the UK, Germany, India, Japan. Come on, uh, worldwide. <laughs> Come on. <laughs> now, now you in your church in South Memphis on the corner. Don't don't nobody even really know about you, but the people that you interact with can. Uh, and now, all of a sudden, <laughs> through local ministry network. Uh, you're going to be on the corner uh, uh, of Germany, India, Japan. Come, come on. Uh, uh, there are some believers there, but but we need to be able to uh, break up out of ground. So, see, we got to expand the kingdom. See, we got to expand the kingdom. <laughs> I need y'all to grab that revelation. Well, our, our assignment for local uh, uh, ministry network is to expand the kingdom. We ain't finna change nothing. We just add to what's already there was already there. And so I want you to understand that. And uh, so, so when you begin to look at this, that, that, that uh, uh, the opportunity that you would now have through this network, watch this. Uh, I, I'm going to blow you away with this here. I'm going to blow you away with this. Okay, watch this. On our network, when you when you are on our network, you won't just be on uh, Roku or Amazon. When your broadcast is uh, on streams, <laughs> now I'm going to get into the details of what you need to do. It's going to stream live on both of them at the same time. <laughs> Come on, somebody shout favor with God. You see, it, see, see, it's not gonna. Why? Well, want you? You won't have to choose Roku or Amazon. You you will get to choose starting out. Now starting out, this is what we're doing when we're starting out. You will be able to stream live on Roku and Amazon, the top two, at the same time. Come on, at the at, somebody said the same time at the same time for the same price. Huh? Jesus, help me. So, uh, and why, watch this here. And, and understand this, understand this. We're going to be 24-7, 24-7, seven days a week. Seven days a week, okay? Now we got other, <laughs> uh, uh, Bishop says, kingdom building at, at the best. Yes, sir. Uh, and, and watch this, and, and Roku, and I want y'all to see, understand that Roku and um, uh, Amazon is shown in 4K. We talk, I might know 720, 4K quality. So it's going to be off the chain. Now, we got Apple TV coming, okay? 
Excuse me. We got Apple, Apple TV coming, okay? But uh, Apple TV is a, a is a different animal. You know, we're working with things, contracts, and all this stuff with them, but they're coming. So, so they're going to be the basically the top three major uh, platforms that's going to be out there that you will be uh, uh, you will be uh, have opportunity to be a part of. OK, then we got some other things down the road. I ain't going to throw out everything on the day. I, I, I'm not really trying to sell you. I'm not trying to sell you. I just want to introduce you to the opportunity, the doors that God is yet opening. This is not just for pastors. OK, this is not just for pastors. This is not, uh, uh, I'm telling you now, uh, that this is, you got a real calling from God and you believe God is, is, is going to, uh, uh, going to utilize it. See, you, you might not can get across the water. You might not can get, uh, uh, right now, not, not right now, but those across the water can be able to see you and then somebody will call you and bring you there. See, see opportunity, your gift will make room for you. <laughs> See, see, we just got to be true and faithful to this thing. All right. Now, let me share this with you. Uh, let me share this with you. All right. Now, there's some things coming. We got other things that are coming. I, I understand this is not just uh, this is not just uh, just for this right here. Uh, the price. Now, I'm going to give you this up front. The price for uh, a 30 minute broadcast is only going to be fifty dollars a broadcast. Is not going. I'm, I'm. We ain't trying to break the bank. Are you hearing me? Fifty dollars a broadcast. Now I just told you when I was on ABC, I was paying five hundred dollars. Okay, five hundred dollars. Now fifty dollar broadcast means that you will have to have. Uh, you got to edit your stuff yourself now. Okay, because if we have to do some editing, which I don't want to do, we ain't gonna try to get into that because that's a headache. Because I've been in this thing a long time. I understand. Uh, most people are going to be last minute. They're going to get the stuff in last minute. And then we're trying to get, see, that's going to be too much. We have charged too, <laughs> too much money for that. We don't want to do that. Okay. We want you to uh, have your stuff edited. You don't invest in it. It's going to bless you. Have your stuff edited. Okay. And I uh, want to give you some pointers. Uh, uh, and if you sign up, when you sign up, we're going to uh, give you information uh, on how, what's going on right there. We're going to give you information on how to uh, 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 have it set up properly so it'll meet uh, the qualifications of the stations, okay? Uh, uh, now, uh, Roku is a little different. Roku is a little different, got different, and they got different rules. And so, uh, uh, you know, uh, certain things we're going to share with you, what you can have, uh, not about your preaching, but uh, certain things, you know, like commercials and, and stuff. You want to put certain things you want to you sell products within uh, uh, so they'll look different. You can't do it directly in your broadcast, but we have a ways around it where you can still offer products, okay? And, and uh, one of the things, this is things I want to share with you all and try to help you. You got to get to the next level. Whether you sign up with us or not, if you go do it, then, uh, then you need to be ready to understand how the change and how they'll look different than TV, okay? Uh, so we got to understand that. We got to follow the guidelines, not to shut you down. OK, so so it's important to understand that. But there are ways around that on your uh, at the end of your broadcast on the outro. You you, you send us a little clip of uh, uh, if you got uh, some major program coming on or you want to sell a product or what have you. Things of that nature right there. You need donations for whatever. Then we can get a 30 second uh, little clip about that. And then we add it on at the end. OK, because that's our time. OK, and, and so, so we're not uh, and we're not violating the rule, but you still can get it in uh, and it's still the time that you paid for. OK, and so it's a little different things like that. Uh, uh, but this is one of the things you want to make sure. OK, you want to make sure that you have uh, great lighting. Lighting is great for video. Sometimes I see people stuff on on Facebook. You better can see stuff. OK, you want to make sure that you have good lighting. And then if you're going to don't send the stuff that you're doing from Facebook side shots and stuff like that on it. We need front view. Like I'm looking at you. You look at me. We need that kind of stuff to be on there. So, you know, we want to have good quality stuff. OK, and make sure it's good sounding. Make sure that you're close enough to where you can even you can record off your phone. Just make sure you're in a good position to where. Uh, it can be heard good and clear and good lighting so you can get 
uh, uh, focus uh, get uh, people can see who's preaching, who's ministering. Okay, and that's important. And, and and let some of the musicians know. Don't drown out the sound. Okay, all we hear is music. Okay, you got you know uh, understand that there's some. And then when you're recording, uh, uh, you got especially got a lot of people uh, up behind you and the choirs and things of that nature there. Uh, uh, you got, look, you can't be doing all that walking. And don't be up there asleep. Uh, uh, all that, because you're on camera, you're going to be all that. So, so you got to train your people. Okay. You must train your people how to conduct themselves when, when y'all recording live. Okay. So you're recording. Then when you send it to us, we're going to stream it live. Okay, uh, it's good. You're actually gonna be delayed, but we're gonna stream it live as it is right then. Okay, uh, uh, so it's gonna be important that you understand those things. We'll give you all the information to everybody that signs up with us. Okay, so uh, we'll walk you through the process, and um, we want to open this door up for you. Fifty dollars a broadcast now, Monday, uh, Sunday through Monday. All right, uh, seven days a week, twenty-four hours a day. Uh, getting in early with us is going to be a great blessing to you because you'll be like uh, like uh, our first uh, our first 50 people to sign up with us is going to be what we call our founding members. OK, man, we, uh, it's going to be a whole different thing. You're going to get a whole lot of other perks and we'll talk about that a little later. Uh, uh, I'm going to talk about when those that sign up. OK, so uh, now we uh, um now, uh, this is the thing. Uh, it's be your responsibility to upload, uh, send us where we're going to give you direction on where to send your video. We need it in MP4. OK, you got to do it in MP4. I'm just sharing some information with you. That's the best way to do it. MP4. Um, and, and there's a lot of free software. You can maybe get that and get, get it done. You ain't got to go out and buy no $2,000, $3,000, $5,000 cameras. Matter of fact, uh, you got your iPhone, an Android phone, an iPad, it, it can record. Okay. You can be, you can, it's, it, it's so easy now to get the equipment. You ain't got to do all that. And uh, you wait till you get, get to that level, be buying all that other big stuff. Okay. Uh, you know, when we start doing uh, uh, stuff, I recorded my stuff off. I bought me a $100, uh, $100 camcorder. Then we had the camcorders and stuff. You know, man, put that thing on the, on the tripod and we record. We doing it. Then I had two on the side. I got three of them. We had the different angles. Then we edited to put all this stuff together. Look, you ain't got to have a dead course. Uh, we was blessed to be able to buy a, a commercial camera, but we we did what we did uh, and uh, what worked with what we had. Okay. And it still worked. Okay. Still same quality. Okay. So, so that's what I'm sharing with you. Don't go out and try to put yourself in debt for all that. And we, it's simple. Keep it simple. Okay. And we're going to share things with you on what to do and how to do it. Uh, those that join our family. Now, uh, uh, of course, uh, I can tell you now, the Sunday slot going to go quick. I'm <laughs> Folk gonna want it, but don't worry about it. Don't worry about it. I want to get a Sunday a.m. Tim. Look, remember you going all around the world, uh, and so time zones are different. See, you trying to we ain't just doing locally here. You are gonna be all around. So somebody going, somebody good gonna be watching you. I'm telling you. But I just uh, even when I was doing uh, uh, stuff, I surprised I got uh, 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 people uh, around other states. I didn't even know they were even watching me. Uh, uh, even when I was doing uh, just simple stuff on Periscope, I had folks from Russia uh, getting on my Periscopes when I'm doing uh, doing deliverance and that, you know. So uh, you never know how far the reach is going to be, but we're going we gonna to expand here, okay? So by you being on Roku uh, uh, and Amazon at the same time, you're going to be expanded. What's going on? Uh, uh, TT, God bless you. You're going to have opportunity to be in many homes, okay? Now, uh, uh, so, so it's important that you begin to understand that. So you want to start locking in. Now, this is when the station is actually going live. It is going live, okay? It's going live. Uh, it's uh, July the 7th, the 7th, the, uh, the 7th, July the 7th, right after Independence Day. July the 7th, we are going live, okay? So you want to make sure that you got your slots in. You want to make sure that you're in place. Uh, now, uh, of course, you have to pay uh, a week in advance. You, you can't say I want this slot there. We're going to send you stuff. No, you got to pay. You got to lock it in by payment. OK, this is a business, too. Now, I want y'all to understand. I love you, but it's still business uh, because we got overhead and got people we have to pay. 
uh, to uh, take care of things and make sure things are running properly. And so be up, man. And so we're going to uh, uh, we're going to do this thing. Now, my first 50 people is going to be our founder members. You, I promise you, you want to get in. Now, everybody that signs up now, this is a great thing here. You you probably uh, you probably would get two at least two to three uh, um, days. OK, I want you to hear this. You're going to get at least two to three days uh, during the week because uh, we got 24. So we got to fill slots. So you're, you're going to get you're going to be coming on more than uh, uh, one time. OK, but you're only going to be paying for once. <laughs> Jesus. That week. OK, you're going to be paying for one that week. So you might be on three or uh, three or four times because I'm filling slots. OK, because I know starting out, we ain't going to be uh, unless God just do it. And, you know, if you do it, praise God. But I know we're not going to fill up every, uh, you got 24 hours to fill in one day. So I know we're not going to get everybody because we're on this, everybody's not going to be picking on the same day. So you're going to, but we're going to fill slots. And so you're going to get, you're going to get uh, other times that you don't have to pay for. And then uh, you'll keep getting that until those slots get filled. Okay. So we'll notify you, let you know that what days you'll be coming on bonus days. They're going to be what we call bonus days. You're going to have bonus days. We're going to give you that. So you're going to get more exposure, more exposure, more exposure. Okay. So it's going to be important. All right. Uh, I'm going to, uh, I'm going to, I'm going to give you information. Uh, 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 Bishop, I'm going to give you information. I'm going to get ready to close out. Give me about 10 more minutes and we close out and give you information where I'll give you a link where you can lock in uh, your spot, okay? Get that one spot in there, and then I, I'm going to give you opportunity to choose your day, okay? Uh, uh, you get to choose. See, see, you want to get in now, and so you can be able to choose days, okay? Uh, 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 then after a while, probably the next couple of weeks, uh, you're going to have to take what day. I have to let you know what days we have available. OK, so, so we don't want to we don't want to do uh, a days that's available. I want to get in while I got an opportunity. That's why I said ground floor. But it's going to bless you. Now, now, let me share with you a little vision what I have uh, after we get going before the year is out. Uh, the four years out, uh, one of my plans is to get a building. OK, find me a nice place here that we're going to renovate it. And local ministry network is actually going to have its own place. And how we ain't just gonna operate online. We're going to have its own, our own place. Cause we're gonna have our studio. I know a TBN no longer functioning here, so local ministry network is gonna take this. I'm not saying I'm getting that building, but but we're gonna be we're gonna have uh coming in, we're gonna have shows, we're gonna have different things almost like you see uh, uh TBN and and uh word network. We're gonna have those same type of things, okay? Uh, uh that we we'll have going on uh there in the local ministry network in our studio. So that's not coming up right now. Uh uh, uh the plans followed in place. Uh, by the end of the year, uh, we plan to have a building. Then probably the first year, we're going to launch and open up the doors for our studio. Uh, now, and this other thing I want you to understand. Then our, also our plan is, I'm, I'm just sharing some of my vision for you. I got, you know, I got a gigantic vision, but this is where, where it's going. Uh, uh, we also going to have a, a station just for youth ministries. So you got youth pastors, you got a youth ministry. Uh, man, you want to expand? So, so we're gonna have we're gonna have station a station a dedicated station just for youth ministries and youth pastors only. Okay, <laughs> man, this thing ain't gonna be crazy. And so, so we want to get out there because the young people are gifted, man. They uh, a whole lot of stuff. So, so we're gonna uh, all this gonna be under the same umbrella. Okay, gonna be under the same umbrella. And then not only that, we also gonna, we're gonna have. Uh, we're going to have a dedicated station uh, for uh, uh, conferences and uh, revivals and commit. So so uh, it's going to cost you a little extra for the uh, for the uh, conference. And and because, and, and you know, it takes a lot. We got to be doing you can be in another state. We still be able. And see, this is a great thing. Uh, what some some y'all better realize it is just like with the conferences and and revival. Uh, uh, you don't have to be here in Memphis. You can be you can be in California. You can be in Florida. You can be uh, uh, come on now. You can be in Hawaii as long as there's a strong internet connection. So you'll be able, we'll be able to, uh, we tell you what to do, what you got to do, and then now send us what we need, and then bam, uh, we can have you can have your conference streaming live there on local ministry network conference channel. 
Lord, help me, Jesus. All right, so, so it's going to be a conference channel where you can have your revivals and see, so expanding. So, so, so remember, there are ways around, uh, 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 you know, things where we, we have to follow the guidelines, okay? Because I want the station to get shut down and won't get kicked off. So we want to follow the guidelines, but there'll be ways. And that's why, this is why I want to get to this point here. That's why if you do not have a church website, if you don't have your own personal website, you need to be trying to get that established. You ain't got to go uh, grand, but get something to wear because people are going to want to continue not only see your broadcast, but they're going to want to connect with you. Okay. I'm going to say something that's going to blow y'all mind. Uh, Jesus, if y'all ain't realized right now, uh, uh, see if what we got to understand or what we're, where the church is going. All right. Uh, so get you a website developed. Okay. Uh, right now, our website for Local Ministry Network uh, not quite finished yet, so we'll have it done by the time we lunch. Uh, we got some things I got, <laughs> have things set up in the proper way the way, way I need it, but it'll be done by the time we get it, uh, by the time we lunch. Okay, so so this is the thing: get your website to where, and a website to where people can see who you are, see what your vision are, uh, is, uh, rather, uh, 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 and and not only that, where they can be able to connect with you. Then you want to also on your on your website, you want to uh, look, you want to give them opportunity to become a member of your church so you can have online members. I, I, do y'all hear me? Look, everybody's not going to church in their local area. And a lot of times if they look up because you, you become you, they will. I'm telling you, uh, some of you all minds going to be blown. I want y'all to hear this. I'm going to prophesy to you right now. There's some, why, some of you all, when y'all hook up, and especially with, I'm not saying we don't know one, but if y'all hook up with local ministry network, you have an opportunity to have uh, 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 members outside of your area and probably outside of the country will become full-fledged members if you set this thing up right, uh, that you probably have more members outside uh, uh, your, your local area, that kind of mind, they're going to blow your mind. And uh, that where they are tithers, they're givers, they're supporters. And then when you have conferences and stuff like that and, and major days they'll fly in to be there be a part of if you treat them like they're god almighty can, can y'all hear me that this is where your vision got to open up and, and you'd be surprised and then now you'll see you start having resources you announce you start seeing yourself having connections uh, uh like some of the uh, the mega churches you might not be mega in number but you mega in ministry and that's what we want to give you the opportunity to become mega in ministry uh uh because uh, it ain't about the numbers all the time uh, uh and, and you'd be surprised how this begins to happen so make sure that you get to working on it now Get you a website. Get you something that's looking decent. Now, don't be just throwing up anything. Get you something that look, look decent, okay? And where you can receive information, where people, you can be connected, where you can uh, be, begin to uh, get some of your young people that, that's got the technology skills and, and put them to work and let them be assigned to that. And, and you'd be surprised how this begins to start growing. Now, all of a sudden, they have your online giving set up. If you're not already doing it, if you're not already doing it, you're way behind. You need to be start doing it. I was at a church uh, uh, Sunday evening, uh, uh, and then uh, they were asked for an offering, and, and, and I, I, had, I had less money in my pocket than I thought I did. And when it was time to give, I said, oh. And so I leaned over and asked the pastor, I said, I, I, do, do y'all do uh, swiping, uh, 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 online giving? He said, no, we don't. I said, ugh. So, you know, I still gave, but I didn't give what I wanted to give. And, uh, you know, because they didn't want to set up. And, and so make sure that you're setting up. I'm getting it in. I got, we got cash out. We got square. Come on here. I got through, uh, uh, I got give a five. Come on here. Bank of America. Look, I, uh, <laughs> I'm getting it. Then we get cash and we take checks. I'm just saying, make sure this don't bounce. <laughs> so we got, uh, so you can be able to do all of this. Okay. Uh, uh, you want to make sure you're doing this. And then also, uh, we got this coming real soon that uh, local ministry network will be having an app. You can be able to stream right through your app. And so your people be able to download the app and stuff. I'm and it ain't going to cost you no more than what you're paying. Understand all these things. The only thing that's going to uh, increase in price on something because this is separate is when you utilize our conference and revival station. OK, that's going to cost a little bit more get things set up. Other than that, you're going to get uh, once again. Uh, live streaming on Roku and Amazon Fire TV for $50 a broadcast.
That's two hundred dollars a month. Now you can be able to uh, uh, subscribe to us. Uh, you can pay weekly because we ain't trying to stretch it, okay? Or uh, uh, you can do uh, you can pay at least uh, a monthly. That's two hundred dollars a month. Or you can do six months, okay? Now uh, there's no contracts. Okay, but I want to encourage you to do at least six months because you don't want to be on this week and then off next week and doing all that. Because if you're going to do all that, then uh, we're not going to have you on the station because you're not going to be able to establish that it's going to give our station a, a, a bad name. But we got to we got to keep integrity. So we want you to we're not giving you to force you on a contract, but do at least six months so people get to know you. Then you can see what you can handle. OK. All right. Now, um, no, there's some that asked about. How can we do it? I'm telling you, get in now. Get in, get in. What's going on, Ms. Jenkins? Get in now. I'm telling y'all, get in now. We've been about an hour, okay? Uh, let me get the link. Lord, help me. Okay, hold on. Let me get the link here uh, for you. I meant to. Uh, let me see here. I meant to do it this way. But I will copy here. Uh, okay, hold on, y'all. Let me pull it. I got the link. Let me, I forgot to put it on my screen. So let me do this right quick. It won't take long. Let me, hello. Uh, it will not take long. Uh, okay, here we go. All right, so let me do this. Okay. All right, hold on here. Let me give you the link. For those that are interested in signing up, I'm going to put it right here inside Facebook, okay? Uh, let me do that. I'm going to put it inside of Facebook. That way, I've got, we was on Facebook, Lord Jesus. Okay, hold on. Y'all, let me, let me put it inside of Facebook. And I'll put the link inside. All right, I'm going to put the link inside here. And uh, let me do that. I apologize. Uh, I meant to put it on the thing, but then all you have to do, if you're interested, uh, Bishop, you are uh, interested in all you got to do is to hold on and put it in right here now. Now it's going to take you to the place to pay. Okay. And okay, you should have it there. It should have been came up. So all you got to do is click that link and it'll take you right there to uh, Thrive Cart. And you can pick what lock in your time, okay? Lock in your time for those that are watching it now, they're interested. Uh, like I said, this is not going to be uh, the only one we're going to do, but it's just coming out. We're just introducing it. We've been to amp it up. Uh, but you want to you wanna get in. I, I encourage you to be one of the first 50, okay? Uh, because you're going to be our founder member, so we're going to do some great things uh, with this network. It's going to blow you away. And... Um, uh, then we're gonna we're gonna help you expand your ministry more ways than you realize, and because uh, this is a kingdom move, okay? This is a kingdom move. So just click on that link. It should be clickable, okay? Click on that link, and uh, should be able to go in. You can get lock your fifty dollars in. Once I get the information, then you'll be getting emails from us. Uh, we'll be sending you uh, contracts and uh, let me know what day that you interested. See, right now, you can tell me what day you want and what time. <laughs> Lord help. And uh, then you're going to get some bonus days because you're coming in early. Now, now you're going to have enough time because 
Uh, I, we'll give you the deadline when we need to have your stuff in. Uh, I'll edit it, and uh, then we're we'll go from there, get it uploaded, and then we're gonna go to work uh, on cause July the seventh. The local ministry network is going live. Okay, it is going live. So I want to make sure. Uh, uh, so let me put it in again uh, here. All right. To claim that we're going to get off here. Uh, your spot now. Okay. Click. If you have any problems, you can reach out to me and um, I'll let you know. Okay, here we go. Now I'm going to put it in one more time. Uh, this is serious business now. Um, so uh, it's time for you to, I just put it in again and then click that link. And um, and then y'all share this for me. I appreciate uh, you being, you're doing that for me. Share it. What's going on with? God bless you. Uh, man, look, y'all share this here. Claim your spot now. You want to be my first 50 because uh, you're going to be my founding members. I'm, I'm telling you, I'm, I'm telling you, I can have a serious business. Uh, uh, vision and I, I'm a giver and I got compassion for this. I'm telling you all now, you want to be part of this network. Now, uh, like I say, uh, I know we're going to have a lot of outside lookers trying to see what's going on, this and this and that, all that. Well, y'all will be looking and seeing, but you better come old taste and see <laughs> what the Lord is doing because this is going, I'm telling you. So when you look at that Amazon now have overtaken Broku, and Amazon is now have uh, 34 million people, 34 million people that's uh, that's using the Fire Stick. OK, Roku has 30 million using the Fire Stick. And then now watch, not saying all of them, but what if we only get 5 percent of those watching your broadcast? And I'm talking about mine. I'm talking about yours. Watch this. And then the great thing about it is uh, 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 the great thing about it is. Uh, on this network, you'll be streaming if on both platforms at the same time. Jesus, for fifty dollars a broadcast, two hundred dollars a month. Are you hearing me? I'm to I pay five hundred dollars when I was on ABC, five hundred dollars a broadcast, and drop it off every week. <laughs> And God made a way. And so now I'm just saying this is not just for pastors. This is for those who have a real calling uh, to preach and teach the word of God. And you feel led that God is expanding your ministry. You've been hearing God finna, uh, 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 put you, uh, you've been a preach around the world. So uh, see, catch that. You've been prophesied too many times that God finna preach around the world. And, and look, you don't have a passport, but you don't need a passport right now. You're going to you become global. And then, okay, so you'll get known. And then by the time you get that passport, people already know you. Because <laughs> I seen you on TV. I watched you. Oh, see, that's what I'm talking about. Uh, Y'all be surprised. People, so many people know me. I only know them because they didn't see me on TV. When you come back on TV, they they, they know my voice from radio. Okay. Uh, my, uh, uh, my, my boy, uh, Bishop Whitaker, uh, who's on here, uh, look. He listened to me on the radio, didn't know me, and he had never seen me before. And we was at a, uh, another friend of ours church service and revival, and I came over there. Then I was uh, heading to the parking lot, took my car, talking to my wife on the phone, and he didn't recognize my voice. Never seen me, but he listened to me on the radio all the time. And he said, I know you. You're the relief doctor. Said, yeah, that's me, man. And we've been friends, my best friends ever since. Y'all, do you hear me? I, I'm so, so you never know who knows you. But this is going to be an opportunity. Look, I got to get off here. I appreciate your time. We're on a good hour. Uh, man, uh, I, look, look, share this for me. Talk to your other preacher friends, other pastors. Let them know. We're going to be putting out other stuff. I want to come on and get the ball rolling because July the 7th, we're going live with whoever we have. And a lot of y'all, some of y'all going to get bonus days, and then we'll let you know. Then as the slots fill up, I'm telling you, because this 24-7, you're going to be global. You're going to be live. Uh, this is a move of God. This is a kingdom move. Um, and, and it's going to bless your life. Uh, don't don't procrastinate. Don't be all this to this and that. Look, y'all don't have to know me. But know this is God. Okay? Know this is God. I don't care what folks say 
about whatever. I know, I see, I've been this thing. I've been preaching 31 years. I know how it goes. Well, you know, because my name ain't gigantic, but I got a good, good name now. And, and, and I ain't just local, okay? But because my name ain't gigantic, see, this, this is a whole purpose, one of the whole purpose behind Local Ministry Network. We ain't just running behind names. We we doing kingdom, his name, Jesus, okay? Let's focus on that. Uh, we ain't trying to get no big name. You know, I, 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 God don't bless me no more. He done bless me. I done been, God done bless me to be able to do a whole lot of things in ministry. I never thought I'd get an opportunity to preach on platforms. Never thought I would, you know, and I ain't never had no big name, but I knew his name. So, uh, look, don't miss this. That's all I'm saying. Don't miss this. Then you're going to be trying to contact me and try to figure out how, uh, okay, okay, Bishop, what? What, what, what? Let, let me put, let me put the phone number in too. Let me do that. Let me do that before we get off. Let me put the phone number in so y'all can be able to contact, uh, okay, uh, local ministries uh, network. And so, man, this ain't something we just throw together. Been on, this, this has been, been at the altar for a long time, okay? Hold on, hold on. This has been at the altar for a good minute, okay? Uh, it's just time for the release. All right. I don't want uh, two, three, five. I got to remember that number. Okay. The brother ain't, ain't as young as used to be. All right. All right. You need to call for more information. I'm just going to, I'm, I'm just going to share with you some things. Okay. Like I said, we're not trying to sell nobody, but I want you to, I, I, I want you to uh, um, connect. It's going to be a blessing to you. What's going on, Prophet Jay? God bless you. It's going to be a blessing to you, okay? So you can be able to call, and that's the phone number. Then you want to, you got the uh, links there. If you want to go sign up, I'm just telling you, it's going to bless your life. Lord Jesus, it's going to be a good thing here. I got to get off here. Uh, look, I'm excited. We'll be coming back on. I'll be letting you know. Matter of fact, uh, probably before the week is out, we'll be back on another. Uh, uh, we're going to take it a little bit further. And uh, we're um, going to lock some things in. Okay. So um, um, I pray that this has been a blessing to you. I pray this has been an answer to many of your prayers. Okay. In ministry. I know how it is in ministry. You know, uh, you gifted, and you some 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 people have got stagnated in ministry uh, because that like they not get many preaching opportunities. And y'all know preaching opportunities are very scarce now. Okay, but whatever you do, don't compromise. Just try to get no preaching opportunity. Try to get no platform. This <laughs> I, did, did y'all hear me? Don't you compromise. Try to get no platform. I know it's scary. What's going on, Bishop Morris? God bless you. Uh, we're getting ready to end, but look, catch a replay of this. It's going to be a blessing to you, man. Um, look, preaching opportunities is scarce, and you got to be able to know some people to get on certain platforms. You don't have to do that. Local Ministry Network is going to be that platform that's going to span you greater than any one individual can do for you. They might have a little clout this net, but watch what I tell you. When you have an opportunity to be able to minister live, God Almighty, you, we talking about you, somebody that probably you might not even preach four or five times this, this year, but but all of a sudden, now all of a sudden, I ain't saying that this is going to give you a lot of preaching engagement. What I'm saying is going to get an opportunity for you to utilize your gift to expand the kingdom of God. This is what this is all about. And if so fit other people see you now because they know who you are, because I believe that God called you. Man, that's a word in you. <laughs> Jesus, we just got to get you out there so people can know. I believe there's some great things getting ready to come. All right, Bishop, bless you, man. We're looking to have you, man. Definitely want you on here. This is going to bless you $50, and you're going to be streaming live on Roku and Amazon. Uh, uh, man, TV, look, I'm telling y'all, this is real stuff, real stuff. And at the same time, I ain't talking about, no, at the same time. So you're going to have opportunity to be before, before 60 million people, not the now we know all of them. If you can just get five percent of them watching you, yeah, you listen to the word of God coming from you. 
man, and, and man, it's affordable. Come on, fifty dollars a week, I'm gonna bless your life. And that is that's just the start. We got Apple TV coming. We got some other platforms coming that's gonna bless your life. Uh, it's gonna bless your life. And uh, hey, uh, the price gonna stay the same until the Lord change it. Uh, okay, that's where it's gonna be. But you want to be my first fifty to get in, be found in members because we got some great things that's gonna be coming for you. Uh, some stuff that others won't get access to. Uh, see, that's why you gotta get in. This month is gonna be found in members month. So get on in, contact me. I got my phone number in there. Give me a call. Don't call me late tonight now. I call it, but you leave me a message, your name, I will call you back. Okay. Uh, and then they're gonna it's a link in there. I'm gonna put the I'm gonna put the link in again for you. Uh, if you just want to go ahead and lock your spot in, you want to lock the spot in, don't get the $50 in uh, and, and lock it in. And uh, so, so you definitely want to do that. Okay. So, uh, so, so I want you to uh, go ahead and do that because I'm telling you, this, I know everybody going to want Sunday. You know, now, well, let me tell you something. Sundays and certain times of day, early morning and certain time of night, you know, uh, and in, in regular media time, those are they high dollar time, so they're gonna charge you more. They up the price. <clears throat> they up the price on you. We're not doing that. Okay, what well, we are not doing that. It's a flat fee. It, it don't matter what time. Okay, so I want want to let you know that we we, we are not doing that. We we uh, 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 we not uh, price gouging or nothing like that. Okay. Uh, just want you to go ahead and get in. I promise you, you want to do it now. So when you call me later after you see what's going on, cause I know uh, some people just ain't gonna believe that it's going. Uh, it's it's going forward. We're gonna be here a while. Okay. Yep, we're gonna be here a while. So I just put the link in again. Okay. I just put the link in again for those. Uh, just in case you want to go ahead and sign lock your spot in. Do that, and then we'll get with you, send you uh, contracts, information, and we'll give you everything you're going to need, walk you through the whole process, what we're going to need for, from you, okay? Uh, but if nothing else, take some of the information that I have given you to get your ministry for the next level. Uh, time has changed. We got to get on out here. I'm telling you. Um, uh, Travis said, wow, when I hadn't even gotten into the meat of the thing yet. <laughs> but I uh, got some other things we're going to share with you, what we're doing. Uh, Y'all pray for us. Uh, like I said, we will to be a blessing to the kingdom of God. Who knows, some of you all, uh, when once we get our building the first of the year, uh, bring you in, uh, you get on the set. I have some of y'all hosting shows. See, we, we're doing all of that, okay? We're doing all of that. Uh, uh, so we ain't got to be behind just waiting, looking at everybody else. We're going to do our thing, you know, and, uh, you know, this is not about black and white thing. Uh, this is a kingdom thing. So I don't care what color skin, what creed you are, as long as you say by time believe in Jesus Christ, you've been called by God. This is a network for you. Okay. This is a network for you. So y'all continue to pray for us as we go forward. Look, it's been good. Uh, you know, who knows? I might jump back on here later on and just talk about some things. Uh, not so much, of, but you know, I throw it in anyway. But y'all going to see a lot of the local ministry network. Y'all going to see a lot of that. Okay, so look forward. Y'all gonna see a lot of me. Uh, praise God, and uh, we're gonna go forward in Jesus' name. Praise God, Jeff Rick. Come on, get yourself together, boy, and, and let's do this thing. Praise God. Look, I love all of you. Want to remind you that you never be broke another day in your life. All your needs are met, over and above. You increase your stature, wisdom, and favor with God and with man. Listen, relief doctor signing off here. We'll see you next time. Be blessed.